close the door. We got Billionaire Mike here with us too also, y'all. And then, look at the Technica. That's rare, ain't it, Mike? Very rare, baby. Okay. Very rare. Talk that talk then, Mike. What's the dealio, Martilio? It's your boy, Josh Ryan. And I'm coming to you with another banger video because you already know I only post bangers. We are at a new spot. What you see that? The big no limit, big body bins with the, the cat that, the cat drive that car. And this here, well, this is no limits because, you know, we be in OC Saint Squad. So this is no limits shop, OC shop that they have, which, it's still getting built out, don't worry, but the progress they have made so far, it will look sweet in here. So, welcome to No Limits New OC Shop. This has been getting built for, I feel like it's been a month and it's been a long time. This is my first time actually being here and seeing it, so. Like I said, all the progress is working off, paying off. You know what I'm saying? So it's pretty, it's pretty fire. So when it is finished, I wanna see if one of y'all will be the first one to come in here. Well, actually, Jorge, he said he got like three people already lined up to freaking get whatever done here, like a wrap or whatever down here. He said he might get a need to get a bigger place because if you already got three people and then same squad, y'all gonna come in flood and whatever y'all need. So I'm thinking when I, when I bring the C43 back, we have an update on that. C43, has been completed but we have a technical difficulty that we talk about in a future video but c43 completed when it comes back should i wrap it or should i just keep it like white with the blacked out look or should i do like murdered out all black 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 on black comment down below and let me know if i do road trip in the c43 baby amg road trip in the baby amg out to cali get it wrapped at no limit comment down below and let me know if we should do that or should we just keep it how it is I don't know. If you're new, don't know about the C43, go back and watch the old videos because they all bangers so you can catch up on the daily life of JSL, King JSL, sir himself. And once it's complete, we'll be back and we'll be able to see this whole thing complete like we got the new lights right here on the ground. Um, the floor, they painted the walls. When it's complete, it is going to be fire. And I finally don't have to drive up the studio city la all the time because dude that's like hour 30. right when we were about to leave mike walked to the car what the heck mm -mm -mm. bad luck nah. it's a second flat now nah, that you know less what, than three months you know why that happened why because that had to introduce you to no limit <laughs> we got jorge here jorge gonna save the day don't worry mike you'll be oh, right sorry but i do it you know, yeah. I want to, uh, you know, no limit, I put that shit over there. <laughs> <laughs> Man, try to get a customer. Yeah. <laughs> but nah, that John Lena, you look like my car, Mike. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. I just noticed that I'm like, why is the back tire looking like that? Or like, or like it's leaning. Yeah. So then I came and looked and I saw that. So I'm like, oh, damn. Yeah. So, you guys remember when we uh, went to MFR, Mike called me out. He said, I can see your car on the race ramps leaning. You need a new shock. I said, uh, five minutes later. Uh, make the, the side. So Mike had to get a tow truck and now we're gonna follow the tow truck to the shop down the street. This is a crazy thing. This video is supposed to be about, oh, new limits, new shop in OC, man. You in OC, you can get some work done at no limit in OC, man. You know what I'm saying? And now Mike, Really need some work done. No limit coming through for him. Keep going. <laughs> Be your near Mike on a tow truck. Mm -mm -mm. AAA always coming in handy, you know? Facts. That's so crazy. Pretty quick though. I noticed y'all noticed when I called him, but it's still the same. The light you know? That was fast. I think this was the fastest tow truck. Because you got that membership, that premium membership. Uh, the billionaire mic for y'all. <laughs> no, that's it. That was pretty fast though. So Mike's car is going on a tow truck. I want to see something nasty though. Got to follow the tow truck. He went left. So how did he make that left turn with all this traffic? Dirk got enough money, gotta turn him off, champ. And we have made it to the shop. Should I move it? No, you're good. Oh, I'm good. Back. Yeah. Yeah. Tap in, let them know. Yeah. <laughs> Back. Do the rallies where it's like when you go through all types of terrain, it's too risky. 
Yeah. Nah, you be right. You gotta be like me, Harry. Yeah. <laughs> billionaire Josh. <laughs> nah, that, that's you. That's billionaire Mike. I don't know why he said that to me. But uh, we got our boy Harry taking care of Mike. Harry was just on the rally with us, and now he gonna get you right, Mike. I know it's all love, man. So you gotta, you gotta know people gotta treat people right to treat you right. You know what I'm saying? Right. So you know everybody connected. One thing is, Stain Squad, when you get out here and stuff. The thing is, California is so disconnected from the rest of the country, I believe, from my own experience, is you see everyone out here, clout is so much easier to get, so everyone can be bigger on social media out here. It's a weird thing, but I think it's just because of the disconnect. So once you get out here and then you actually start networking and meeting people out here in California and stuff, you notice that the world is way smaller and it's just a normal life for people. And everyone knows everyone. Especially in the genre that you're in, especially the car world, everyone knows everyone, and that's how it works out here. And it's just normal people, normal things, but everywhere else on social media, it's just huge, which is the craziest part about it. But hey, man, that's this new world with technology is amazing, and just learn to capitalize off of it, and that's the best you can do, and be great in life off of something new in this world. And it's always good to meet new people as well. And it's always good to network. Remember that, Saint Squad. You always want to network because at the end of the day, everyone knows everyone, and then you build an empire that way. Trust me. You can't grow by yourself. Build an empire with others, so you'll be fine. So, Mike's car. We're leaving it here, actually, at Harry's shop. So, you know, shout out to Newport Drip because I needed tires bad, but you know, I might get some Sticky Johns back here. Actually, my shocks is out. Steph was making fun of me talking about, I mean, you can keep riding on your shocks if you want to die because I guess, you know, aerodynamics, downforce, all that stuff kicks in, right? And then the shocks could just like make the car lose traction, but that's why we won't go as fast on turns. We'll be all right. But anyways, I might still up some new tires on y'all saying squad, <laughs> you know. But anyways, dropping Mike's car off. I haven't ate all day. I've been doing business all day. I need to eat. I'm starving, so I'm about to go, go get some food slide into my race car. Dang, look at Mike in the passenger seat. Man. <laughs> Still in the Lambo. Facts, yeah. I guess we're going to be driving an Aston Martin tonight. Wow, yeah. yeah. The other supercar. I told you, I'm billionaire Mike. 8.01 PM. Right by the door. Mm -mm -mm. That color is freaking nuts, bro. It is nighttime. By the way, welcome to nighttime. It's your snakes will cut the bruise. Look like your curl is on. Look at that Mopar. We done pulled up to a night beat <laughs> in a Black Series MC20 and SL. Oh. oh my gosh. And then Adam driving the SL. Oh my god, he almost snickered dude with them. Yeah. The Hot Wheels. You finna get one, huh? I haven't been to one of these meets in literally so long, dude. So long. And you pulled up different. I pulled up different, huh? Not no scat pack. Wow. Imagine seeing these cars at this type of meet. It's so funny. When you want them ones, you know you make anything happen. Believe it, you'll achieve it. No fake. That's the cop over there. We gone, we gone, we gone, we gone. Tomorrow. Day two. <laughs> Billionaire Mike back in the game. Yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, so right now Mike got his tire fixed. We are about to head up to Lambo Newport Beach because there's a couple questions I would like to ask because I'm gonna talk to y'all in a little bit when we get up there and tell y'all the Dilio Martilio how I you guys do know I play on my cross country uh thing so driving across pop up meeting rates all that stuff but it's a couple stuff we gotta get done first before we do that and I'm gonna fill y'all in on it Yeah, 
Facts. I've seen him, Mike. Yeah, that's why I don't get speeded over here, bro. They be out. Facts. Lamborghini Newport Beach. So we got a Tura here, crackling. Don't know why. Tura, Tura. L. I don't know how to say it, but look at this little baby windscreen. This is my first time. Well, I think I've seen this in person before, but god dang, bugs all on the front of it. At least, at least you know they drive it. Just look at the inside. Look at this, and then you walk into Lambo and. Look at this sitting right here. That is fire. So this is the new Countach. The new one that they made, made OP 800 dash for. So 800 horsepower. Wow, this is fire though. So seeing one up close in person, and let me tell you guys something. Like I always tell you guys, it's super rare to be able to see like this type of stuff. So you be out here, you get jaded to seeing stuff like this. Like. I know so many people back home in Michigan will tweak out if they seen this. Me, you know, cool, cool times. You know, first time I've seen the person is cool. I have it. Give me, give me eight years. I get this. You know, after this is a collection, it wouldn't be a main car. You know, just some light. I'm talking that talk, Mike. I know, man. The, the finance manager Jeff here. He just told me he said he wants me to go for it. Should I buy it? <laughs> Billionaire Mike, everybody. That's too what? That's too hood for me, bro. What do you mean that's too hood? Look, look, it's, 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 it's not, look, it's not even fitting. It's standing out. That's how it's supposed to be. It's, it's supposed to be seen, bro. That's Mike. That's drive right there. That, that. This is not hood, Mike. Yeah, if it, is, you think that's hood. You got to go to Texas if you want to see hood. And it's slam, bro. Look at that. Uh, we got a purist here. Billionaire Mike. You know, all, all the billionaires are purists. They don't care about... Modify cars, you know. You want to know what hood is? This is a show car. Hood, this is nowhere near hood. Hood, if this was hood, you see some Forgiatos. They have some sixes on there. Hold Put on, some sixes see, on there. Black Performante out here somewhere that's class. Man, they got, they have sixes on there. You better tell Mike go to Texas. <laughs> <laughs> I've been to Texas, Dallas. Yeah, I've been out of Dallas, now Houston. Guess I gotta take a trip. Guess we gotta take a trip to Houston. Facts, I wanna go visit Houston. This blue is fire. I love blue. Blue is like my favorite color, so that blue is fire. Then the regular is 610. Right here, red. Yours, when I get married one day. And then, what is this? F8 or SF, SF90? RIP to everyone who bought SF90s for 1 million, because they're going for 600K now. Like I said, couple, give me eight years, St. Squad, have the car collection, you know, that would just be car on the side, you know, that ain't the main thing. Know, whoever can afford these cars probably didn't care that they lost money. Probably tax write off. Billionaire Mike, everyone. You <laughs> like that. Then we got the Veyron, which will never, ever touch my grad. Look how ugly this thing looks. Oh, it's a Bugatti. That thing is hideous. I'm just a cunning to that guy, though, so what do I know, you know? Actually, I know everything, champ. Through the power of God, I know everything. So the real reason why I am up here at Lamborghini Newport Beach is because my radiators are through, okay? Mike told me to go up, uh, we gotta find some new radiators because I told you guys, we're doing a whole refresh of this thing. So I'm talking like, it goes to MFR, we're getting a full, full new refresh. So I have to write down my VIN and we are going to see how much some new radiators will be because CSF is taking those refurbishing them. I'll be the first Huracan with CSF radiators, which would be fire. Cause I'm a real race car driver, it'd be like that. Let me tell y'all this. First, y'all know how I used to complain about Lambo merch being poo. I just found the hardest thing. Look at this, look at this shirt, dude. Look at this. Front, focus, same squat. Put your glasses on so you can focus, there you go. Look, front, back, fire. And it's a go with the <laughs> I real life be dripping for real. I'm like, every time I walk, it's a waterfall. Straight drip. No fake. Yes, I just bought the hoodie. So here we have two quote sheets, which prices on these cars are not that bad. So people see a Lamborghini be like, oh, the price is probably ridiculous and stuff. So this is what I learned. These right here on the front are not radiators. These front ones are air condensers, which is the smartest thing I think Lamborghini has ever done because imagine your car gets freaking destroyed, right? Like mine is, and it's not the radiator, it's being blocked and saved by the AC condensers because we drive race cars, so who needs AC? 
and uh, Jason and Ryan just pulled up because another thing part of the day is they are buying the car new car today that I have to convince them last night for an hour to buy it and they're buying it so we'll get to that but so radiators on this car the two three front ones are 1700 that this paper says I think this is the paper right here okay yeah radiators two are 1700 altogether I believe and well this is the paper which just sells that yeah 987 for the front one and then the two side ones 600 so 1700 whatever but the AC condensers are more expensive than the radiators the AC condensers are 1900 altogether which is wild makes no sense I know I don't get it but oh well so we'll do that but the thing is we are supposed to be getting custom CSF radiators but I might not need radiators anymore so I don't know I know I like that I have to tell you to get that one my whole plan of the thing is I want to do my cross-country rally right I told you guys I want to drive across the country do pop up meets like Arizona Texas hit Atlanta hit ATL again we used to be there all the time we got to make our comeback maybe North Carolina Charlotte comment down below if we should hit Charlotte as well then up in Michigan do a meet up in Michigan at home take when we finally take the car back we'll hit Michigan as well but I'm thinking I want to do end of June but I should wait because end of June we can do the whole refresh so the hurricane build the we'll say 1.9 okay hurricane bill v 1.9 because look as these got ripped off that's down bad okay ripped off that's nasty looking so no diffuser in the back the car um i don't think it looks good enough for our cars country pop-up drive so this is the question do we wait wait push it back to sometime mid july maybe mid july closer to the end of july or should we still do it? No, actually, because I don't want the AC things and radiators not get air and all that stuff. So I think we wait. Huracan V1.9 V1 build. Get that complete. So we'll have updated everything. We'll get more stuff powder coated. We'll have a new aero kit as well. New kit. Should I keep the chassis on it? Comment down below and let me know. I don't know, but that is the thing. And that is what we're preparing for and getting ready for. Anyways, the homies pulled up and... They are in here at McLaren because. Did you hear him? You know what he said? We're good. He said we'll take it. <laughs> throw me a, throw me a, like 500 in merch though. We need right, some cool. hoodies like we're running out of Lambo. That's the easy part. Facts. You need every car you get. You gotta get the merch with it. Yeah, you need the merch. Always. It's necessary. Facts. I just bought my first Lambo merch. I'm, I'm lit. You know what? How you like it? Messed up. He should have had some whole. How I feel inside, Ryan? Right? Cool. You you should have had a business front saying like, all right, guys, 17 years old, let me show you how to Facts. You heard me, Ryan? You should have had a whole business front. I kind of want another McLaren. Because the whole car buying thing is taking all day, so I am about to leave, get food. We'll see the 600 LT later when they bring it back. But uh, I'm leaving and getting food, handling business, all that other stuff, man. I can't be sitting around, champ. Especially if phone about to die. You got to work off the phone. Phone day, you ain't working, champ. Hey, how that? Mike always wearing the same thing or whatever. The legs were hot, so when I look, when I dress up, it's, it's hot when I dress up. This is what happens when Lex4 goes from $60 a month to $30 a month. <laughs> <laughs> now they know, so now they can see me look a little fitted, you know? It's European hey, swag. Do you want to know how you know you're a millionaire? Because you can see the boy's ankles. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Even the chain, you look even the chain got wow. quality. Look you see that. the ankles, you know in the summer when you wear shorts, you gotta wear the short oh, one. Yeah, look right there. These zip up, you know, these like bubble, these, these zip up, they ain't they like the regular pocket. Wow. No high socks. Billionaire Mike, he rich. But look at this, we got Mike down here. Then we got Ryan's new McLaren right here. My car, random car. Then we got a black series. Bro, we lit. So we got invited to this Lamborghini and by only event that we are all about to head to a mob to together. So it's about to be lit. No fake. You getting this make me want to get another McLaren. You should do it, bro. Add you it think to so? the collection. Yes, sir. Add it to the collection. So I should get a 765 instead of a Ventador yeah. for the upgrade car. Hey, shoot flames not 765. Facts, that is true. Six Little baby says 765, just like the one y'all got. That's me. If I get my 765, my door is going to go up again. And I'm going to say that verse in every single song. 765 McLaren, this ain't the one they got. No fake. Alright, so we are about to head out because Adam 
is back in the MC20. Oh, I gotta clip him. I gotta clip him. I'm doing this on my Snapchat right now. I'm on Snap Heavy right now. So, uh, cause I wanna get verified on Snap, so I'm trying to use it more. So here, add my Snapchat right now, Josh Saint. There you go. Add my Snapchat right now for me. Go ahead, add it. I'm trying to get verified on Snap, man. So I'm posting crazy right now. Cause I used to be super inactive. That's why you know what I'm saying. But we're gonna get there. I get like 130k views a month on Snap. So if you can verify me on Snapchat, just you know, go ahead and do that for me. I appreciate it. Just DM me on Instagram. Let me know when you do it. Thank you, sir. And y'all who can't, just add me and stay tuned for the month. And Austin's driving the SL. Huh? Uh, I don't know, we don't got no more room. And now I'll flip up, start my race car, and we out. <laughs> there go billionaire Mike, but you too cool for school. Oh, we have all made it to Newport Beach again. We were just here hours ago, now we're back. Two days in a row, but um, there's an event. I don't think there's no cameras for it. So if you guys enjoyed this video, if you did, go down and smash that like button, the subscribe, and turn that post notifications so you don't miss any more bangers. You surround yourself around this. You get into private events like this, and you just elevate in life. Everything happens as a snowball. You surround yourself around the right people. You'll be in the right places at the right time, and then you'll learn. Your mind will change. You'll learn how life really is and how to live life how you really want it. Anyways, no cameras. Catch you on the flip side. Next video, it's lit, it's a banger, and I think I want a McLaren again. Peace.